Ken Block. One of the most versatile comic impressionists on the scene today, Ken Block. I'm in love. I can't get up. <laughs> Say, oh. for Oscar Mayer cold cuts. Only baloney. <laughs> Here's Joe Cocker for Delta Airlines. Give me a ticket for Delta Airplane. <laughs> Lose my luggage, I'm gonna take the fast train. Jeez. With Larry King's new theme song. Altoona, hello, you're on the air. Johnny Mathis. <laughs> Neil Diamond. Can the, this is a very beautiful romantic song. Can the lights be changed at all for this? Thanks, that's perfect. Cause I'm New York City born and raised. And now I'm lost between two shores. Mr. Billy Joel. <laughs> I did not have sexual relations with that woman. And you know who I'm talking about. Hillary, that's right. I heard it. With over 100 impressions in each show, this universally received act has something for everyone. A fan favorite is Ken's portrayal of TV and motion picture celebrities. This guy was like Dr. Phil. Because if you don't think what you did is wrong, somewhere there's a village who's missing their idiot. And Ken Block, one more time you are late for my class. You will be terminated. Hey, how did all you people get in my room? Everybody. Wants my body some night. There's Regis Philbin. Regis, I can't believe you're talking to me. Woody Allen. You know, it's great. I'm actually out here walking with my you know, wife and child, who's actually the same person. Ah, <laughs> Jay, shuffle yourself there, doing by size. It is great to be here. This is Johnny Carson. I tell you, I tell you, I'm all right now, Johnny. Okay, you're all right, okay? I tell you, it ain't easy being me, you know? Like my kid. My kid goes to a tough school. One day the teacher said, what comes after a sentence? My kid said, parole. <laughs> I told my kid about the birds and the bees. He told me about my wife and the butcher. <laughs> This is Mr. Jeff Foxworthy. Do we have any rednecks out here tonight? I got a little test for you. If your dad walks you to school because you're both in the same grade, you might be a redneck. If you've ever been accused of lying through your tooth, yes, you'll see this is the cause. Bill Cosby. <laughs> okay, Jerry. Okay, baby. I tell you why I'm 
upset, Jerry. I tell you why I'm upset. <laughs> George! Why aren't you gonna report it? You gotta report it! Report it! Oh, yeah! Oh, well, thank you. Thank you very much. It's great to be here. The other day, someone complimented me on my alligator shoes, and I was barefoot. <laughs> You know you're getting older when you bend down to tie your shoelaces and you stop thinking what else you can do while you're down there. <laughs> Gracie, this one's for you. Smile, though your heart is aching. I love you, George. Right back at you, kid. So don't step on Jimmy Stewart. What a wonderful life he had. Yeah, here's my pal Harvey. You can't see him, that's too bad, yeah. If that plane leaves the ground and you're not with him, you'll regret it. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but soon for the rest of your life, I... Louis, I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Here's looking at you, kid. Scent of a woman, we admired Al Pacino from afar. And Charlie, you look danger right in the eye, and you say, hoo <laughs> Sylvester Stallone became a star with only one word we could understand. <laughs> Adrian! See trees of green, red roses too, and I say to myself, Babu Bass, what a wonderful world. Oh, yeah. Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming. See you again. You've been great. I enjoyed it. Thank you, great. Experience it for yourself. Ken Block. <laughs>